the one ZPO man here, or AKA Zach from the Sonic Bros here. Today I'm going to do a tutorial video for once. Yeah, uh, so unexpected, a tutorial video. Let's get into it. So, what we're going to do today is how to put extra costume slots on Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. So like today, for example, you're going to do Mario. Because you know, it's a me, a Mario. Anyway, so yeah. So first, this is the Mario pack I download. Link will be in the description. There's a lot of different Mario costumes, including something based on the, like based on the original NES Mario, Mario Maker Mario, Flying Mario, a lot of different Marios. But we're going to do that today. So first things first, go into Data, Fighter. Go down to your character if, since my go to Mario and since my mine is green because I already have some mods for it as you will see right here I have two mods for it but we're gonna add some more so we have to do go, go to do body and then then there should be these mods and they will have every single thing you need so what we're gonna do is drag them into the body folder yeah they just add then we want to go into groove. We want too far. We want to go to UI, and then as you see, it will have every single thing that we need. And we do not need these copies for some reason. Let me just delete them all. Okay, sorry about this, guys, but. I did not even know these were here right away. I'm being completely. I'm being completely honest. How are these even here? Like, and they, and my other ones, they, none of them were here. Well, so what you have to do? If these are in here, which you probably will be for you. Just hold control and just click on each of them and press delete. These we do not need those PNG files. What the heck are they even in here for? 14, 15, 16. Delete. Yeah, you got all the folders now. So just delete all the PNGs and go into and you will have to go into UI replace CHR because what well, these are CHS and what you can do drag them in here now what you need to do is go to data US EN depending on your region I, my, I'm USA USA you okay you go to UI then this will be blue for you but what you want to do is this right click and press extract but I already did that so let's just go to my folder okay mine is I just placed mine in a random folder so okay so mine would be in this one so you have to oh and I also forgot also go into global parameter um Global parameter dot menu dot menu. Okay, we get the point. Anyway, extract that. Then go to where your Smash Explorer is. Go to extract. Go into the folders, and you should put them in the same folder as the. You should put the UI character dot db. UI character db and global parameter menu into the same folder. Then you will see this CSS version, whatever. You will need Python with four, two point seven, and it has to be two point seven. And you will need this CSS editor. So what? So you get that? Make sure these aren't all. So this, this, and this aren't all in the same folder. Then just open this. Then you should this there's a there's another CSS that is called parameters.exe. Don't mess don't 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 
waste your time getting that. This is a lot more easier. Because that has like hexadecimal st and stuff like that. This has all the character names. So what we're gonna do is Mario. And since there were 16, like I'll show you real something real quick. Just to make sure you all get a clear and understanding of it. Some of you might be so confused. So let's just say we go into character and yes it has all the characters, but let's say we go into Mario's. Wherever we can find it. Oh there we go. See this ends with sixteen. But we go here. It this and the 15. They count zero, right? Here, as a costume, believe it or not. Believe it or not. So, yeah, you gotta make sure of that. Then now we... So, it's really 16 costume slots. So, we gotta go 16. And guess what we do? File. Save. Successfully save, it should say. So, then we just have to... X out of that. Then it should be saved right here. And we don't need all that stuff. So what we're going to do is go back to data and US thingamajig. And go on to the same folder and just put this in there. Then it should be replaced. Then I guess we have to do now. Project. Build the mod. Okay. Then, if it says up here, not responding, which it should in any second, right, yeah, right there. If it says not responding, okay. It's okay. It's totally fine. It's like the most okay thing you could probably ever get. Because, guess why? It's not, re it's just trying to load all them, trying to build all the mods, so. Yeah. Then let's just go into where... Yes, my desktop might be a mess. That's kind of one reason why I have it like this. So we go to... See, this was extract. This was the export. So it should be exporting it. Uh, we'll just wait till this is done. If you want to see the mods, it is right here. See the Mario expansion pack. And I will also have the P, not the peach, the Sun Shadow Pack, third times a charm. So it's for you to download, which should be. I'll just go back, type in Shadow Pack. Should be this one right here. I will also put this in the description. I will do a gameplay video on it. If you look right here, it has Super Shadow. That looks like that would look like a Hyper Shadow looking thing. Um, just some costumes for Shadow and Normal Shadow. And guess what? You don't even have to replace any of the Sonic. That's look good. Is it done yet? Nope. So yeah. And I will link these guys' channels into the description. Nope. Yes, I watch TWD98 and SMG4. Actually, I have an SMG4 mod for Smash Wii U as well. Kind of cool. Kind of interesting as well, speaking of the witch. So, we just gotta wait. It usually, t if depending on how many mods you have, it takes a while. Let me just check on my recording soon. Okie dokie. I don't want that. Okay. Just a sec, it should be done. Real soon. Okay, I was right by real soon. And we don't even need this anymore, so click. Yep. Ah dang! I ah, dang I don't want to pretend that didn't what Okay, so now we need the SD card which let me quit get mine. Because, well, I forgot. I wasn't prepared. Because you need the SD card. Now, I will have the files links. The file links in the description. So you can get Smash 4 Explorer and stuff. 
but you need to just go to export release copy every single thing in here so pretty much copy is this this and if you already have mods in here you can just delete this because guess what you got new mods if you guys want me to make a mod pack I will do it for you guys so we gotta go now paste and this would take a while depending on how many mods you have and see like yeah it takes a long time to get a gigabyte full of a gigabyte full of mods that would take a while like and by a while I mean like a long time on well, speaking of which I got a new capture card as you might have saw by my previous videos of Minecraft VCT GP and Smash Wii U test which that did not have mods even though I already did the modding process um I didn't want to have the mods with that video this is a test video so yeah should be done okay dokey so now we gotta go into the Wii U okay so now we're at the Wii U and what you have to do is go into the internet browser at the bottom second third to the right then you have to go to the link in the description loading dot ovh wait some w so I'll just have in the description then you have to click on SD caffeine plus kernel and then you just well click submit the reason mine is on Mac is because I made it. And then you have to go back to the internet browser, go back to it, select it again. And this should this is your last time doing it. And on the gamepad, you have to press A. That's all you have to do. So now we're in the Wii U menu and we can open Smash Brothers now. Yay! And after it, it, it speaking of which, put your SD card in if you didn't. <laughs> Hopefully you did. So now it's just waiting for it. Wait for it. And then you will have... I just press no for that. Because, well, don't really care about it. We care about the mods, right? Yay. Anyway. So it should be loading up soon. As you know, it's Smash. It takes a while to load up. There it goes, loading up Smash. And then once that is loaded up, go into Smash Battle. And then you check to see if you in see if it works. And there it is. That's my mods. So and I'm just gonna show some gameplay of Shadow Mario versus Shadow the Hedgehog. So pretty much double shadow. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe we'll see y'all next time because i'm just gonna show you a quick battle with them and i don't really need to be there i would think so yeah see y'all next time bye bye